Labs. It has some of the best loot in the game and some of the most concentrated quantities. But it's full of chads and raiders. Your average player may be a little intimidated, but maybe if you rat a little bit, you can get some of that for yourself. In this video, I'm going to show you some pretty decent camping spots that most anybody can use. Before we get into it, if you haven't already, consider hitting that like, hit that subscribe button. Come out with new videos every Friday. I also stream over on Twitch every Sunday, Tuesday, and Friday. Let's get started. Okay, now first off, we're going to be on the second floor, just down from where the red and violet rooms are. You're going to come into this little office area. And there's a real common spot right there, but the one I'm more going to focus on is over here. Jump on top of this desk, you can do a little run jump, and get on top of these cabinets. Getting elevation is a good way to catch people by surprise. So, putting yourself up above this, and go ahead and kill people as they come on in the office. If you're having issues getting on top of areas like this, consider using a stem like the L1. Also, to show you the other one, get on this desk, run, jump. You're right by the door. This one is peaked a little bit more because it is more common to use, but it's still very useful. Or, if you want to do this with a buddy, you can each take one of each of those spots. Furthermore, right over here, you get on top of this desk over here, you can run and jump across. Obviously, a little riskier to be seen through the door. Another one of those situations where you shoot people shouldn't really expect to see somebody up there. So hopefully taken by surprise. Next, we're going to be over here by red. Now there is this spot right here I want to show you. I don't necessarily recommend using this because everybody peeks this. They're always waiting for someone to be sitting here. It's more so just to let you know that it's there. But I want to show you over here. You got to do like a little jump crouch at the same time and you can get right on top of this. You are a little exposed still, but people don't really expect it. Next, we're over here by like near the manager office, come in this back area. And this is a pretty high traffic spot. You come over here, you can get on top of this by jumping on top of this railing, backing up to the very tip, and then again, doing one of those jump crouches. Again, similar situation though, you are fairly exposed, but if you have like a single or a duo running by real quick, you should be able to take them both out before they realize where exactly you're shooting at them from. Next, we're a little bit down from there. This is at the end of the bridge coming from the red and violet area. You have these boxes. You can jump up. Do another one of those jump crouches. Now, if you look down, you're able to squeeze underneath this vent. You'll have to shoot out this window like I already did in order to do this, but you can aim right down this area. Again, a little exposed, but people don't really expect to see you there. You have people coming up behind you too. It's super easy. Turn and look at them with making very minimal noise. Next, we're gonna be over by the hangar door. Come over here, and jump up on this railing, get on these boxes, and then jump right across onto this container. Now, labs, you are not able to shoot at the lights. That's a little bit of a negative, but you have a real good view of all the areas around you from up top here. To include if they open the door and raiders want to come in. Next, we're over here in the offices. This is the one closer to green and blue. You go towards the back. You can get up there, but I feel like you're a little more exposed because of the back wall. Over here, a little more shadowed. Come up here, do a little jump crouch, get on top of the bookshelf. Just sit there and wait. Now we're over in the other office across the way. Go up here. You can do it right there, but I recommend doing it on this one. Jump on the desk, then jump on like the back of the wall. You can actually walk through this little circle and it helps give you cover. Just wait for guys to come inside the office to loot. Next, we're going to be over here where the blue card has a chance to spawn. Jump on those little medical containers. And then again, do a little jump crouch and get on top of this cabinet. 
have people come swinging in and you shoot them right in the back. Now we're by the main elevator extract. If you have high enough strength, go over here, jump on top of these tanks, and then you're able to lean out and get people as you're going for extract. Uh, this is a little bit risky because unless you're high enough strength, you won't be able to get back out. But again, bring something like an L1 stim gives you plus 20 strength. You'd have no trouble getting out. Now we're going to be over by the medical exit. Now, so these pillars right here, you want to use them to your advantage. Come over here, stand near right across from the elevator. Jump on these containers. Kind of hide behind these pillars so you don't get seen as easily. And you can see people coming from that direction as well as you have the door right in front of you to the right right here on the connector and then behind you you lean over you can see people coming from that direction right towards the elevator hope this helps guys that are having some issues with labs or maybe just want to you know change up their play style a little bit or if you are one of those labs chad then hopefully this helps you not get ratted as always like i said before Hit that like, hit the subscribe, stop by next week for another new video, and as always, I will catch you guys next time.